Uh, we're very excited today to, uh, to host a uh, uh, distinguished ambassador to Slovakia, the United States ambassador to Slovakia. And, uh, and that really uh, represents the strength of Cleveland, the strength of the ethnic community mix in Cleveland. Uh, I just learned that uh, there's probably close to 100,000 people in Cleveland area from Slovakian in origin. Uh, that's wonderful. They worked very hard all these years. I practice in Marymount in the center of Eastern European communities and we're very familiar with the Slovakian and the Slovenian and the Polish population, wonderful, hardworking people. So we're very uh, privileged today to uh, host uh, Ambassador Theodore Sedgwick. And I'll just say a few words about his background. His best background is that he was a resident of Gates Mills, Ohio, <laughs> and a graduate of Hawkins School, so you can imagine. And then uh, 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 the world grabbed him in different locations. Uh, he was confirmed as the United States uh, uh, Ambassador in June uh, uh, 30th and sworn in July 14, 2010. Ambassador Sedgwick is a business executive with experience in the publishing and timber and timber industries. He founded Passion Publications, a specialty publisher focused on energy, defense, and environment markets, and served as its chief executive for 20 years. More recently, he founded IO Markets, I'm sorry, IO Energy, an online energy information company covering the natural gas, coal, and electricity industries. In his world, it was a mini Bloomberg for energy. Uh, he was president of Red Hills Lumber Company, a producer of pine flooring. Prior to his appointment, Ambassador Sedgwick served on a number of private company boards, including Inside Higher Education, Atlantic Information Services, and Washington Business Information, Inc. Ambassador Sedgwick is a member of the chief executive organizations an organization of global business leaders. He graduated with honors from Harvard College, cum laude, where he majored in Ottoman history. There is a promise for history majors. <laughs> <laughs> he grew up in Gatesmith and attended Hawkins School. We're very delighted to have him. We also are going to present uh, the next speaker after uh, Mr. Ambassador, who is the distinguished mayor of uh, Bratislava in Slovakia, Mayor Milan Vtatishnik. He told me, you remember uh, those of you who are members of the council, we talk about our program, the National Visitor Program, and uh, we've been hosting close to three, four hundred uh, guests a year. Uh, Mr. Vtatishnik was one of these guests in 1991. He came to the United States for the first time and in his words just a few minutes ago, he said this was a dream trip for him that opened his eyes uh, to the United States uh, life and, and uh, 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 politics and economy and the world. <clears throat> he has a different background. Uh, mayor Bilan Vtachnik uh, uh, has been the mayor of Red Slava since December 2010. He completed his graduate studies in 1980 in theoretical cybernetics. Uh, at Faculty of Natural Sciences of Comenius University in Bratislava and obtained his PhD in Mathematics and Physics in 1987 and served as an Associate Professor at the Department of Theoretical Cybernetics. Uh, so he's into sciences big time. In 1990, Mayor Vtachnik became a member of the National Council of the Slovak Republic and in 1998, he was appointed the Minister of Education. In 2004, he also became the head of the newly created Department of Applied Informatics. Then in 2006, he became mayor of uh, Petslaka, which is a city district of Bratislava and then Bratislava itself. We welcome you to Cleveland and uh, they have a sister city uh, program with the Cleveland City that was started apparently in 1990 and hopefully it will be revived and propelled into the future to have a uh, more uh, close relationship uh, between Cleveland, Northeast Ohio and Slovakia and Bratislava.
Mr. Ambassador.